Excuse me, snitches. Hey. Saturday, October 6th, Pitt State football taking on the University of Central Missouri at home, looking to make it 5-0 to start the season. Let's kick things off in the first quarter. The Gorillas are moving the ball downfield effectively on their first drive when Jason Spradlin comes out of nowhere to rip off a 24-yard run, setting the Gorillas up with a first and 10. And a few plays later, Anthony Abinoa would connect with John Brown from 13 yards out. That's Brown's fifth touchdown of the year, and Gorillas take a 7-0 lead. A three and out by the Mules would give the Gorillas the ball back, but when their drive stalled and they were faced with a fourth and six, Andrew Castaneda came in to punt. But wait, it's going to be a fake to the wide open John Brown down the sideline. That plays good for 32 yards and a fresh set of downs. Later on in the drive, the Gorillas are set up near the goal line, and who do they call on? Trez Tillman for the score. He takes it in from one yard out, and the Gorillas extend their lead to 14-0. Over the next two quarters, Central would respond with two touchdowns of their own, and after a Connor Frizzell field goal for PSU, the Gorillas would head into the fourth quarter, holding a slim 17-14 edge. But that edge wouldn't last for long, as UCM quarterback Coulter Smith would capitalize on a long mule drive by taking it in from one yard out for the 21-17 lead. And for the first time all season, the Gorillas would find themselves trailing in the second half. And although the territory was unfamiliar, Abanoa and the Gorillas would respond. Midway through the drive, Abanoa would find John Brown for a 46-yard catch, and on the next play, Spradling would get it done on the ground once again, rushing 15 yards to set the Gorillas up inside the 10-yard line. And a few plays later, they would look to the big man, Mandel Dixon. He would punch it in from one yard out, and the Gorillas take back the lead. And it would be a lead that they would not relinquish. A late touchdown from Abanoa to Brady Letchworth would make the final score 30 to 21 in favor of the home Gorillas. PSU 5-0 to begin the season, and heading into the annual Fall Classic at Arrowhead with a little bit of momentum. For full coverage of the Gorillas press conference following their win over UCM, and extra on-field interviews with players that were not featured in the press conference, become a Gorilla Access member today.